The political thriller written by Laos Penny with Hillary Clinton is poised to hit the big screen after entertainment company Madison Wells purchased the film rights to the book, according to reports. The 2021 book, State of Terror, follows a pair of middle-aged women who team up to stop a terror threat that comes in the form of a president and his administration whose failed efforts at diplomacy and international relations put the country in danger. According to Variety, Madison Wells picked up the rights to develop the book carrying Hillary's name into a feature film. The company describes itself as a company with a strong bias towards stories for, by, and about badass women, as well as people who love pushing boundaries. Gigi Pritzker, the billionaire film financier and chief of Madison Wells, praised the book, saying, I have been a fan of this genre of literature my whole life and once I got my hands on this book, I couldn't put it down. We rarely have the opportunity to see women as the main characters in a complex international thriller like in the book Clinton co-wrote with novelist Louise Penny, the sec of state character, Ellen Adams, is forced to prevent the terror plot after what is obviously fashioned as an administration led by a troublesome, Trump-like president, called, Eric Dunn. During the story, Sec. Adams not only battles terrorists but faces a series of sexist microaggressions that she defeats with the girl power of her female while she takes potshots at her Trump-like president. Critics say she also levels both barrels at a Joe Biden-like president who is characterized as a fool, USA Today wrote. Clinton's fool, Biden stand-in president is named, Doug Williams, in the thriller. So the novel can reasonably be read as settling scores with both the man who beat her, Dunn is not far short of an elected Hannibal Lecter, and the man who then bested him, The Guardian's Mark Lawson wrote. It's been nearly three years since Hillary Clinton and her daughter Chelsea launched a Hollywood production company. Clinton says that the basis of the story was conceived during the 2020 presidential campaign when she hoped Joe Biden would beat Trump. Still, the plot gets actual history backward. In the book, it is the Trumpian character who gives Afghanistan away to the Taliban. In reality, that travesty occurred under Biden's watch. The novel also portrays the Trumpian president as having profited from scheming foreign governments furthering her false claims of Russian collusion against Trump that have, in reality, Donald Trump is the only president in modern times whose personal net worth fell during his presidency, instead of growing exponentially. Clinton added that the Ellen Adams character is loosely based on the personality of former Under Secretary of State Ellen Tauscher, who died in April of 2019.